All right, so assuming that building a house is the most common thing people do in Minecraft, I'm going to be teaching you how to build a house like this, or like this, or like this, or like this, or even like this. So without anything further ado, let us get right into it. All right, so I've already started building a house right here. And as you can see, there are quite a few things we can take a look at here to improve our building skills. So first of all, if you want to build a realistic house, you need to make it as if it was realistic as well. So what you want to do is start with the foundation. So the logs. So what I would first do, I would first build these four pillars. So that means this one this one this one and this one build them all up about 10 blocks and have space in between them for about 20 blocks and for this 10 blocks to make it a bit of a rectangle here now you can also extend it over here for five blocks and then make a little bit of a garage if you want to that is optional all right, so what you want to do, you want to pick out where you want your door at. Now, I chose it to be just a little against the wall here, so that it will be nice and close next to the garage. And for the entrance, I used these cobblestone stairs to make it a little dry. And then I used the fence as if they were carrying the cobblestone stairs. I also placed two glass panes right in the middle of the beams and surrounding it with spruce trap doors. And I made a few nice flower pots as well to decorate it a little more. What also helps is creating a randomized wall. Now, what do I mean by this? As you can see, I just randomly placed four blocks of the same color to vary it a little more. So as you can see, I placed stone, andesite, cobble, and stone bricks. Taking a look in the inside, I haven't really done the interior yet, but you can see some progress. The same wall from the outside, no double wall or something. As you can see, we added a few beams here because we don't want it to be a monitor's box. And if you take a look from the inside, I've also done that over here. And I also placed some torches, light source under them. You can also make stairs upstairs. So you can also have the stairs randomized and you can place trap doors next to the stairs to make it nice and safe for you to walk on. And then we got some more stairs leading up here and this will be like the final floor where we build the roof. So yeah, that is the progress so far. And we can add some fences over here to add more detail. And we can place some trap doors over there. What we can also do is grab a barrel. We can place a barrel like that to add more detail in the, into the wooden beams. As you can see, I added the barrels and they immediately make a lot more detail. What we can do here is we can add these beams over here. And as you can see, what we can do, we can grab cobblestone stairs or whatever you would like. Grab a spruce trap door and place it like so. We've also added some pillars here. Cobble fences, spruce fences, and more cobble walls. And if it is one block more, you can also add an iron fence in between. Now we're also going to begin with the roof. So we're going to be cutting off the ends of the wood here. Now normally it would be like that. We're going to cut that off. And we're going to make it go like this. We're actually going to make it a little shorter. Now this is a nice roof and all, but there's a little extra tip. Every block that it builds up, do that. There we go, that does add some nice detail to it. These beams are free to stay, so we can just add that over there. We can just delete a stair there. And it heads straight into the roof. Nice. Right, so and for this extra garage, I actually added a roof to this. And I added logs here. I'm going to make this randomized just like this, but I'm having a bit of an issue here because this is very flat and obviously we don't like flat. We want detail. So what are we going to do here? Well, the answer is pretty simple. I think we're going to make a diagonal roof that goes slightly up. Um, let's see what, how, how are we going to do this? We can go ahead and do that maybe. Yeah, that seems pretty decent because then it also reaches out to that. 
So what I'm doing here is I'm going to be making a normal staircase there. Instead of doing consecutive staircases like this, I'm going to be doing the first one normal, but the second one upside down. And then the third one normal, fourth one upside down, fifth one normal. Alright, and then we can place these stairs in between that. Perhaps we can make like a little little staircase over here. And it does go in through the middle of that beam. So what to do with these beams? I think what we're going to do is go to the section nature, get woods, and grab this oak wood. There we go. Place these stairs like that. And place trap doors like that. There we go. That does look very nice. Alright, so now for the upper floor. I think I'm going to be keeping this as a ceiling for the nice raw look. But I am not sure what to do with this, this wall. Perhaps we can just like fill it up like this. And we can make a window over there. And do the same on the other side. Alright, now we can add these fences. Alright, let's get iron bars. Another fence. Then a wall. And then fill that up. Yeah. Bro, whoever lives in this house is so lucky because they can just watch the dual arena from their house. Right, so as you can see, that does a pretty good job of how you build a house. But obviously, Minecraft is more than just building houses. I mean, like for example, there are so many things you can do just with just cobblestone. You could make like an entire like fountain. Alright, so let me see. I'm going to be making something on the spot right now. Let's make an X of cobblestone slabs. Let's place them like that. Alright, we can place some walls over here. Make sure you use everything to your advantage, guys. Alright, place some upside down stairs like so. Place them like that. Place a wall in between. Place some normal stairs like that. Place one, two, three. And place that. And there we go. Yeah, as you can see, that does not look too bad. Obviously, I've done better. I mean, look at this pillar. That is much better. And if we go into the boss, we can also see a lot more better pillars. These were also made by me. As you can see, these are very cool. So yeah, as you just saw, those pillars were better, but... I only had cobblestone, so my options were very limited there. But as you can see, it still look, it doesn't look that bad. So my final tips, well, just be creative. And I know that is easy to say, but really, just take a good look at what is in your inventory. There are so many blocks in Minecraft, and they're not there for nothing, you know. You can use them all. So yeah, Minecraft does indeed have endless possibilities. But anyways guys, that is going to be everything I have for you today for building tips and tricks. Thank you guys very much for watching. If these tips were helpful, make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you later.